Okay, really fast, I have to preface this. I was sick in the video, and so like I blow my nose a lot, and my nose got really dry, so there's like dead skinned skin around it. So just don't mind it. Hey guys, okay, this truck is so close to me right now. So last night, Jessie and I went out um, with her little 80 Pie sisters, and they were amazing and awesome. I'm excited to hopefully continue being friends with them. Yeah, I made my first friend. He's in my sociology class. Super exciting stuff. Yeah, I'm going to the mall today. So I'm gonna get back, put dinner in the crock pot, and then um, hopefully go to Salvation Army. I went to a store that Jesse and I love. I think somebody's like grandparents died or something because the decorations that were in there were absolutely amazing and they had so many. So that was awesome. Not that someone died, but I benefited. I'm sorry. Anyways. Yeah, so Salvation Army, I want to get some more decorations. What else is happening? Um, I got one of the final pieces for my little costume for tech and I'm so pumped. I'm so excited to go and see my friends and my buddies and I miss them so much. But Jesse, Kaylee and I are probably going to go to KA which is so exciting. I don't think I've been to KA since literally last year. Last night, Jesse and I realized that this is the first time that I'm actually, that I've like gone out with her. I talked about in the last one, like I don't go out and I don't give a shit about not going out. I'm not sick, by the way. I don't have COVID. I just have like a cold. I got tested for it, don't worry. Cause I lied to my professor and said that I had a fever. And then I realized that I actually could go to class cause I was feeling better. So I had to go get tested immediately to let her know that I was okay. I feel weird about sharing it, I guess. This is like public, you know what I mean? Like, I know nobody gives a hat's ass, a rat's ass about, about what I have to say and stuff like that. And I, like, I, I know that nobody's actually looking at these, but the thought that potentially the person that I would be talking about finds these would be humiliating. Absolutely embarrassing. I faced my first rejection today. First, like I'm not bothered by it at all. Like, and that probably sounds shitty, but I just mean it in the sense that like, I literally was so excited to find a friend. I was so excited to have a friend. I was so excited to have somebody to hang out with. And I get a text today being like, yeah, I'm so sorry. Like I'm talking to somebody else. I just thought you should know, which is totally mature and so honorable and awesome. I, I didn't, you know, I, I'm not, I wasn't gonna be like, oh yeah, of course, like I thought that's what we've been doing. Like I'm not a bitch, you know? I am, but I wouldn't be a bitch in that way, you know? And I don't mean to be that person that's like, I've never been rejected, but like, I haven't. Like I've never been rejected. Okay, mm, that statement is definitely a lie. Technically I have been rejected before. Let's not, let's not get too crazy out here. And I don't even know if you can count it as reject. I, you know what? I am counting it as a rejection. I just thought I would share because it's, it kind of makes me laugh. Okay, today's my first rejection. Woo! We're celebrating by getting myself some starbs. So sorry that like all of these have to be in my car. Our walls are kind of thin. Yeah, I don't know. I think I would just be embarrassed if Jesse came into my room and I was talking to my phone. Don't have a lot to update you on is because I bought a new journal. So I kind of forget. I don't, like that's why I journal just to like get stuff out and like uh, talk about it. I have to refuel. Fuck. I don't have anything else to say and I'm gonna stop this spiel of just talking to talk. Just talking to hear my voice. So yeah, I hope everybody has wonderful month this October. I hope everybody gets rejected at least once. You know, it's fun. It's fun. And it's a part of life. Thanks for listening to my spiel. Bye. Love you.